It is 1221 on this Wednesday, the 26th of January. We are live. We are local. It is Central Valley Talk Live. I'm Austin Reed coming to you from our Tower District studios inside the Mike Briggs building. Here's how it looks in Fresno in the Tower District today. Beautiful. What another gorgeous day across the Central Valley. Highs will be in the low 60s. Enjoy it. Hey, we are talking food. You know, it is the lunch hour right now. And if you're hungry... And you're thinking, uh, you know what? I'll go out today. You got to check out this uh, new restaurant. It's called Mi Cafecito. Mm -hmm. It opened on September 25th. Yes. Now, you guys are kind of right near us here in the Tower District, just at Manchester Center in, inside the mall. Yes, inside the mall. Um, and you're the owners. Tell everybody your name. Evelyn Gutierrez. Hello. And I'm Hassan Macedo. Well, welcome, guys. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. So, Thank you. okay, uh, who wants to, to begin with... How this all started? Well, we started this dream five years ago. We wanted to open a coffee shop uh, on the west side by Edison High School. Mm -hmm. uh, things didn't work out well. We got a space, but we went back and forth with city, with permits, all that. Uh, and then COVID hit. And then the last thing, a drunk driver crashed into our building. So we had to relocate. Oh. And we were lucky enough to find a space in Manchester Mall. And we've been there since September. How, how's it been going? Actually, it's doing very good. Uh, we have a lot of uh, offices and schools within Manchester Center, so they, they've been very welcoming to us. Um, so tell me, uh, kind of, let's go over a little bit of the, uh, the, the menu, what, what, what you offer. We focus on Latin American coffee beans, so we bring our coffee from as many as over Latin American countries. So we have from Peru, Salvador, Mexico, Honduras, Cuba. So we're trying to get as many of, of our Latin American coffee beans into the valley. And they have to be fresh. They have to be fair trade, single origin. So we're trying to keep to bring the best coffees that we can here. Our flavors have to do with our culture, our flavors. We have um, our signature lattes are inspired on Mexican oh. candies. Okay. And uh, our uh, flavors, uh, we have horchata. Orchata lattes. We have uh, a special ones like right now we're running the Valentine specials. Mm -hmm. And um, you know, and all of them have like unique and like um, soothing tastes. And uh -huh. some of them have like really fun, you know, fun names to go. Like um, we made a couple of drinks called like our, you know, my crazy eggs, uh, <laughs> the, the rebound, and uh, or but yeah, the rebound's like my favorite favorite name so far. But you know, <laughs> that's great. I love it. Yeah. Now, so is it just, uh, my apologies, is it just coffee and drinks? We have, uh, we offer breakfast burritos as oh, well. Oh, yes, okay. we do have uh, and burritos throughout the day, sandwiches, things like that, fast things. Perfect. Okay, cool. So uh, a, a lot, having lunch there is okay. Yes. You, you have yes. the food and the drink. So um, do you plan to continue to kind of come up with new drinks and, you know, especially like go with the seasons and stuff? Yes, we actually have been creating, uh, we created a special Halloween uh, menu, we had a Christmas menu, uh, and now we yeah. have a Valentine's, and we're also offering plant-based energy drinks, so uh, they're very refreshing, healthy, uh, even little kids can take them because they're, they're perfectly plant-based. Right. So we do uh, play, they're very, very colorful, and then we use a lot of candy, so a lot of our teens and, and students from the mall love them. Um, you know, the other cool thing, too, is as we're looking at some video that you sent in, um, Manchester Center, th there's a lot of synergy there right now. Mm -hmm. uh, the Ross just opened up, right? Yes. Um, and aren't they they're, they're in the process of turning the upstairs into some maybe some low-income housing or something? I heard about um, that. I heard something about it. Uh, management hasn't really tell us all the plans that they have, but mm -hmm. I know uh, they have a plan to move to us. We took the... I'm pretty sure for the people that are familiar to Manchester, the ice cream shop was there for many years. They mm -hmm. were there for 17 years, and we took that space. They moved out, and then we took that space. And I know management mentioned that they want maybe in a year, two years, all retail will be facing Blackstone, and all inside will be maybe just what you mentioned, or right. they may have another plans. But uh, in the future, all retail will be facing Blackstone for sure. Um, the the other cool thing, though, about about you guys is this is this is a niche. This is different. Um, yes. What you guys are doing? Talk a little bit about that. Whoever wants to take that question. Let's see, um, yeah, because like um, 
with the whole um like you know what like what, what my mom mentioned with the whole coffee beans right you know like we get um different beans from you know everywhere from Latin America so like you know so like that's like one of the main things that you know we focus on and another thing that makes us different from everywhere everywhere else is that um our signature coffees are different too like for example like we brought up the horchata latte but we also have um masapan which is like a um peanut butter um uh, like a peanut butter um, powder, mm -hmm. like, you know, candy. Um, we also have a duvaline, which is, like, a really popular candy for, like, you know, for um, little kids that I think, even, heck, even, even still little kids like to eat it a lot and, you know. And, um, and especially, like, right now with our, um, with our Valentine's menu, we, do, we put, like, um, stuff that you usually don't really think about. Like, um, for, for example, like the um, Crazy X, that one has... Um, Van um, that one has vanilla and cherry in it, and it's like something that you're like um, you think to yourself like vanilla and cherry, you know, it, it, you know you question it, but once you taste it, you're like, this is probably like one of the best things I ever had. It's you know? really good. Yeah. Um, do you guys have uh, other plans for the rest of the year? Um, any any other expansions or? Well, we're looking into. Um, I know uh, since we've been um, in the. We just had an interview for ABC 30, and we exploded. So we have a lot of people suggesting us locations, mm -hmm. and um, we're looking into Hanford mm -hmm. at this moment. Uh, mm -hmm. There was a space that is open with a, a drive through Actually, I was looking for a drive through before yeah. we actually moved to Manchester. And there's an opportunity there, so we'll maybe opening one in the future in Hanford. And uh, our plans are to expand. I think uh, the main key for a cafecito is to bring a little taste of home. We know there's a lot of people that, for many reasons, they cannot go back. Maybe money, maybe different reasons. And to bring them a cup of coffee from their from their home country that makes a big difference. And that's what we want to do. Yeah, it, it feels like you're back at home. Yes. You know. um, okay. Uh, hours of operation. Let's see, um, from we're open from. Mon on uh, Monday through Saturday, we are open from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Okay. And on Sunday, we're open from 10, 10 a.m. all the way to 6 p.m. Perfect. And uh, right inside Manchester Center uh, on the Blackstone side, right? We're, uh, yeah. it, it's easier to find us if you park in the back by the okay. old Sears Auto Park building. The okay. entrance, you will find us right there. Yeah. Very good. Uh, thank you so much for coming in today. Thank you. Thank, thank, thank you for your You'll see me us. there, okay? Perfect. Right, perfect. We'll wait for you there. All right. Very good. Thank Especially because I mean, right on, I'm drinking Folgers coffee. So. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You need to go see us. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank Appreciate you. It. Thank you for having us. All right. I'm Austin Reed. You're watching Central Valley Talk. Thanks for joining us uh, during the lunch hour here today. We'll be back with another guest in just a bit.